Guys, good morning. Good afternoon, good evening, good night. Not sure why you're catching this. Big on Matinius Dini here. I want to talk to you about the reason why people don't retire early. I think it's super simple. Um, but I made the same mistake for half my adult life. And uh, that's what I'm going to chat to you about this morning. Just out for a little walk with this lad. Where is he? There he is. Beautiful sky behind me, as you can see. Fabulous morning, nice and still. So let's get cracking. If you like the content, all we ask is that you hit the like button. Um, nothing here is financial advice, we don't do that. I own and run Ireland's first Bitcoin consulting company. And uh, for five years now we've helped people use Bitcoin to retire early, despite what their financial advisors told them about it. And kept them out of the world's highest performing asset. Because we take pocket money out of their pockets. But anyway, we give unbiased information. And uh, that's why our clients are so successful. Because Bitcoin is the highest performing thing. And uh, my personal opinion is that's going to continue for the next decade at least. And that's why everyone who comes across this content will eventually have to use Bitcoin. Just like everyone uses the internet today. Even though back in the early 2000s, you know, very few people used the internet. I remember when we first got in the house. Anyway, so today's Friday. Uh, a lot of people are finishing a working week. Uh, this week some people will work 40 hours and uh, this month people will work possibly 170 odd hours and this year a lot of people work 2,000 hours 2,000 hours of their life a lot of time and over their lifetime people will work 100,000 hours some maybe more 100,000 hours now my uh, knowledge I want to share with you is that 99% of the people, it's probably 99.9 if we're honest, who do this, who work 40 hours this week, 170 hours this month, 2,000 hours this year, and 100,000 hours over their lifetime, 99% of them will never spend just 10 hours trying to figure out how to keep the money that they've exchanged all their time to earn. Okay, how money works, how they can get the money working for them. And this is what I say, when I'm talking to people and clients, I say, until you understand how money works, you will have to work for money. And when you understand how money works, you can have money working for you. And it seems so simple. And it rolls off the tongue uh, quite easily. But, however, hello. However, 99% of the world still won't do it. They won't spend 10 hours. And Sometimes when I have these conversations, people say I don't have time. I mean 10 hours of study, I don't mean 10 hours of YouTube videos. Okay, because that's, bu that's biased. Unless you're watching my stuff. <laughs> Maybe it's biased. It's biased to trying to kick your ass to get you to retire early. <laughs> because I think it's such a shame and a waste that people just waste their life in the machine, feeding the fiat world. Bitcoin is a beautiful world and I want to accelerate its adoption. That's why I put out so much free content to try and wake people up and uh, help them to do a little bit of study but it takes study and it takes work <coughs> okay so sometimes people say do you have no time and the easiest way to find time is to uh just say oh see you've got your phone in your hand there it's never out of it <laughs> myself included could, 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 could i just have a look at it there let's just see your social media consumption ah two hours a day <laughs> I could build another business if I did, if I dedicated two hours a day to it okay and that's the irony I'm getting sucked into being scared being frightened consuming all conspiracy stuff okay and that's all well and good it's you can spend your time doing what you want like I'm going motorbike racing for the weekend and some people say like that's stupid Danny that's dangerous what are you doing you could kill yourself and I'm like yeah but it's my choice, I want to spend my time that way and it makes me happy. So if scrolling through social media makes you happy, by all means, scroll more. Exercise that finger, keep flicking, baby, okay? But if you're not happy where you are, now you've got to change what you're using your time for. And you have the ability to do it. And if you change it from mindless stuff that wastes your time, because your time is your most precious asset, your time and your Bitcoin, the Bitcoin that you will own in the future, the two most precious things uh, that you own, apart from your family okay your time and your bitcoin 
a lot of people don't realize that but they will okay just like a lot of people didn't realize that the internet was going to be used by everyone on the planet now they do but you know 25 years ago they didn't so everyone's going to have to learn how to do this and you can do it you have the choice if you want to change what you're spending your time on and uh, educate yourself learn a little bit it comes for everyone so simple um, oh look at this good boy <laughs> is he a boy or a girl a girl, a girl. oh she's a lovely girl <laughs> hello <coughs> now piston see that so Beautiful morning here. Guys, do me a favour, if you like these videos, you want, the, you want to teach the algorithm, show you good stuff instead of conspiracy nonsense, and uh, time waste some videos, hit the like button. So, my, my challenge to you today is, if you're not happy, start doing something about it. Productivity, okay, it's what it's all about. Start learning. If you haven't read the Bitcoin standard, read that. And I'll give you one thing, I'll give you, give you a little story here just an example um, and it'll, it'll help you make sense of how this works so I said read the Bitcoin standard are you going to retire if you read the Bitcoin standard probably not I didn't okay it takes a little bit more than that come on Eddie <coughs> so come on come on come on, come on. so I'm into fasting okay I actually have a company in fasting I own a heap of companies including this one and uh, the companies work for me. I don't work for the companies. I guess you would say that's why I have a lot of free time. But we're fasting with Dini. Uh, sometimes people will do a fast, and they'll be like, you know, the week's fast. Fasting is the healthiest thing you can do. The slogan of that company is "Fix yourself in five days," because you can. Fasting is the most powerful thing on the planet, and uh, it's absolutely free to do. But people need help, and that's how I have a company, and people pay me to starve them, believe it or not. But I changed their help, their health. Change their blood pressure, change their cholesterol, uh, and a whole host of other ailments, including just being overweight or unhappy. But uh, <clears throat> I've had a fella do a fast, okay? One fast once. Lost a bit of weight, and then went on holidays and weight came back on. I was like, damn, it didn't work. <laughs> okay? Now, have you ever gone to the doctor? with an ailment and they gave you one tablet one little pill he said pop that thing into you there now and you'll be brand new no it takes a course of medication it takes time for stuff to work same with fasting you can have a wrecked metabolism it's not going to be fixed in one fast you will do a lot to repair it but if you go back to your old ways and go make a pig of yourself on holidays of course you're going to get fat again it's not magic the world works on proof of work not magical powers okay that's how ethereum works that's how crypto works on magic Okay, bullshit magic. Excuse my language. Most people don't understand the difference. Bitcoin is connected to the real world, connected to reality, tethered to reality, the physical reality. Nothing else has that. Nothing else to the size or the network of Bitcoin. Okay? So it takes time. It takes time to learn. And at the moment, you probably know nothing. And that's okay. It's okay to know nothing. But where you get your asymmetric edge is, if you can admit, I know nothing. And I'm hungry to learn. Whereas with most people in money, I always find that they think they know it all. They they hear you but they don't listen. Okay? They see you talking, but their brain is so distracted from all the bullshit in their head that it's just not sinking in, it's not saturating. And that's why you've got to overcome that. And that's why you really have to make it your business. Okay, to immerse yourself into the content. Hold on, no. notification going off. You gotta make it your business to immerse yourself into the content, into the communities, into the networks that are going to take you where you want to be, okay? And that's something that I think I'm pretty good at, immersing myself in the networks. You know, sometimes I pay a lot of money for them, um, but I always think it's money well spent. Well, this move up this way, actually. It's got a long way around. I always think it's well, it's well worth it because you get the return. But it takes work, like, because naturally we all have our existing network and that sort of keeps us morning. That keeps us basically in our life. And if you're not happy in your life right now, well then clearly 
your existing network isn't serving you. So you've got to make it your business. And you've got to defend your network. Sometimes things get into your network and people get into your network and they're not a good fit. And you've got to distance yourself from them. And you've got to, over time I found, I learn and don't. Things come into my networks all the time that shouldn't be there. And sometimes you don't notice them. But when you do, you've got to stamp them out. Because if they're affecting your happiness, if they're affecting the direction you're trying to take your life in, or trying to live your life, they can't be there. Why? Because they're going to influence it. And uh, a lot of folks have been heavily influenced by an algorithm. Okay? I really feel bad for a lot of kids, and I'm on a massive tangent here. But uh, parenting has been outsourced to an algorithm now. And, uh, you know, it's like, oh, then you can't speak because you don't have kids. You don't know what it's like. I do. I had parents, and they didn't, they didn't have a tablet to hand me to distract me. But uh, I see the effect that it has on their brains. And by Jesus, if you want your kid to be successful, it's the number one thing you can do is just take the tablet out of their hand. Don't give it to them, and they will dominate. They will dominate their competition. Because you can see it now. Any else on the stream here? What's it like trying to get uh, service? in uh, cafes and that. I remember being a barman, working in front and back bar. You know, maybe 50 people in it, all screaming for points on my own. Got it done. Nowadays, three people at a coffee truck and they're probably waiting 15 minutes before they even take the third person's order. It's just the level of IQ, the level of concentration, the level of uh, the people is dropping. And it's unfortunate, but it's fortunate in one instance is if you're trying to uh, if you're trying to get yourself ahead how you want your kids to get ahead it's pretty simple don't let them become distracted don't let the algorithm destroy their brain but it's a lot easier said than done because the algorithm not only is taking the kids but it's also taking the adults anyway I've got a situation going on here <laughs> poor piston putting them live on telly so I'm gonna have to deal with that guys hope you have a super day remember cheers for the taking if you want, study money. It is the uh, most important thing you'll do in your life. And then you won't have to work as hard if you want. Or if you work as hard, you'll just earn more money. Guys, Dinny out. Thanks for being here.